how do we do? How do we handle the things that come along? You can say that that impact us, but how do we stay in alignment? Again, so I've coined this process, the conscious clearing messenger RNA process, the use as needed to restore your sense of well-being, your well-being life expression. So again, messenger M stands for messenger. So we are to be a messenger of light received into the heart and out into the world. And when we're aligned that way, then again, it gives a sense of well-being spiritually, emotionally, mentally, physically. But when we recognize, when we recognize things come along that, that irritate us, our heart contracts, we may have that oh no feeling, why me? Why did this happen to happen to me? Our mind gets twisted. And then you can say in that moment, we have a choice. And in sharing together, we notice we, we've been checking, catching ourselves to not the fault to the patterns of shame, fear, hate, and greed, okay, which are pervasive through the world. And you look at the world today, you can see how there's been a defaulting on a mass scale for the world to look like it is in respect to these things. So for our, us who are interested in well-being, and extending well-being, we're catching ourselves, and we're seeing what it takes to stay in this alignment of being a messenger of light. So it's a matter of being deliberate. So when our, we have that oh no feeling, our mind is twisted, we have a choice in that moment to be deliberate. Deliberate in terms of uprighting ourselves and breathing. Now that quick coherence technique we talked about, it's so important to just simply upright yourself when you feel like you're being impacted and breathe. And we breathe in and we breathe out until we can get a perspective, a perspective that allows us to remember and affirm what you love, what we love. And that brings perspective, perspective that allows for forgiveness. You can say for yourself saying, getting twisted, or, or someone else you feel that may have impacted us in, in, in a harmful way. And then a matter of being large, being large, understanding where a person may be coming from, who's projecting, you'd say, hate or, or greed, and allowing that to be neutralized with conscious understanding. So recognizing, neutralizing, and then A stands for appreciation. Appreciate, appreciate the place that you provide, appreciating the integrated part you play with all. So when this comes to this point where you, you, you've allowed something to, to stop within ourselves, you come back to the place of, of playing our part, which allows for this oh no feeling here to become, oh yes, here's my opportunity. And one example, talking about Dr. Bill Bain, I, I always recognize that when things got hot or intense, there was always an attitude within him. Here is my opportunity. Well, how about ourselves? Here's my opportunity to shift something so that my light stays on and it shines the way for all. Playing our essential part, your essential part, having a sense of destiny where the whole world depends upon me to stay in alignment. And if more of us do that, then it allows for you can say a massive change to occur. But Individually, you can say we come into a consciousness, a greater sense of the light that, that we are, that you are, or you have a, a greater grounding in, in, inside of yourself. That here, I, here I am to provide something. And when we're in that position increasingly, we, we know how to act at rest and in action. So that's the messenger RNA process.